welcome everybody. And today we're gonna to take a look at Black Rifle Coffee Company's Espresso 300 Triple Shot 100% Colombian coffee, ready to drink coffee can. The coffee company needs no introduction from me with over a thousand employees and years and years of coffee products being pushed out with an outstanding social media presence and millions of dollars in charitable contributions black rifle coffee is a company that has become ubiquitous in a number of markets and has certainly shaken up that coffee market to add to the markets that they're looking to shake up they also took a stab at that ready to drink market which from my quick reading on google is a huge market for beverage companies. So let's see how this ready to drink coffee compares to some of the other coffees that I've gotten from my local gas station. This one right here is the rich mocha flavor. It says it's a triple shot, like I said earlier in the video. Branding on the can to me is pretty cool. It's got a nice matted camo kind of in the background. And in the foreground, there's a target with the name of the coffee on it. So nothing to complain about as far as the look of the can. They also have a motto on here, which is serving coffee and culture to people who love America. And that makes sense to me, because like I was saying, they also have a huge social media presence. So serving coffee and culture makes a lot of sense. And certainly they're, they're pulling that off because it aligns with how I think of their company. So for what that's worth, they're pulling it off. Now let's open it and see what we get. As far as like, so as far as like the usual coffee cans that I'll grab that are ready to drink, my favorite is that Starbucks triple shot. The actual, it's I think it's like a cream and coffee. A lot of the other ones I've tried though, haven't been great. A lot of times I feel like they're too sweet or they're too bitter. Kind of like coffee that's been left out maybe in the pot for an entire day or maybe even a day or two. And that's kind of the taste I get on a lot of ready to drink coffee cans. So let's see if this one is a little bit better. Hopefully it's not too sweet and hopefully for sure it's not that bitter taste that you get in a lot of the ready to drink coffees and i doubt it will be because i feel like black rifle will go out of their way to make sure that they put out a good product so let's see oh as far as the smell it's got a nice rich almost like oat and coffee smell to it i don't smell too much of that mocha but it's definitely a very nice rich coffee smell with a little bit of oat in the background oh yeah that's nice Oh, yeah, that's that's a good coffee can. You get that nice coffee. It's a mild coffee. It's not super strong. To me, that little bit of like that nice coffee sharpness and bitterness comes through on the palate. Definitely not that like stale coffee bitterness. The rich mocha is there. It's like a classic mocha taste like you would expect going along with a coffee. And really that that's there's not much to it other than that it's a really good coffee can. I would definitely grab this one again. I don't know if it's gonna replace my Starbucks for cigar pairings, but speaking of cigar pairings, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna pair this coffee with this Cubano from Wooden Indian. And by doing that, we're gonna confirm that the best pairing for a coffee is a good cigar. I did a review on this cigar like a year ago and I thought it was awesome then. Man, some age has really mellowed it out and, and really given it some nice notes. It's got a little bit of floral in there. I haven't watched my review that I did on this, but I wonder if I picked up a floral note. I'm, after I finish smoking this, I'm gonna go and check because it definitely has a nice, like slight mellow floral note now. It's not sharp at all. It's got a beautiful, nice like tobacco core with some coffee in there and this is smoking great I don't know how long ago it came out I don't know if it's been exactly a year or not but this is smoking great right now if you guys still have them might be a good time to pull them out and have some now I 
that's a good cigar. And I will maintain, no matter how nice the bourbon, no matter how good the rum, which, which I do love pairing those with cigars, but man, a good coffee with cigar, I feel like that's just it. That's the best pairing, for me at least. And this one, not bad at all. So there we go, pretty good. I love the pairing. I love how this cigar is smoking right now. The toothiness on there is really good. You can see it. And that's basically it for this video. If you did enjoy the video, give it a like and subscribe to the channel. I've got more content on the way. And have a good one.